continuously I say, you have to have money for get her. DJ Khalid, long time I know she had covered in her. Trouble did it? Yes, people, are going to welcome back to a new upload and a new update. And to the viewers, we have some topics to discuss. And I hope everybody having a good day upon them holiday. I hope they enjoy them day with them family and friends and so on. Yeah, see me? So, first on the topics to have Mr. Vegas followed out and I talk about DJ Kali. Because I look at where I go on some part in the year, I don't really talk about it. Once you have a phone, you must know me attack. You understand me? I say. So, it look like DJ Kali is a part of the country we actually are lose. And Mr. Vegas, I say, you don't know why DJ Kali now followed out and talk about it. Or, you understand? But a lot of people are bash Mr. Vegas, I say, yo, and everything people have come out and talk about nothing for the media. You see me? I say, yeah, some people are just action them deal with. But a lot of people are Yo, if anything else, DJ Khaled would have fouled out and talked about it. Yeah, so a lot of people are defend Mr. Vegas and a lot of people are say, yo, brother, but you come off of the internet. Me I tell you. But viewers may go run on Mr. Vegas I say, and you the viewers can tell me what to think about that topic. You see me? So pre what go on. DJ Khaled, long time you know say I covered in you know? Yeah man, that's why you couldn't like a you like me, you know, and a rate you like me, you know, because you have covered. Yeah man, you're fake. Big time. You see what I'm saying? You run, come Jamaica, Jamaica, you promote Jamaica. Come to the compete mango with spoon and beer things. You see? Right now, if a Jamaica did under attack, you'd have come and say, Yo, pray for Jamaica, pray for Jamaica. You see? And I ask a peace from Jamaica, like a Jamaica you come from. And you own a people, them. I deal with the wickedest type of atrocities we ever see on the earth in our lifetime. And you can't say nothing. Nothing you can't say. You can't say, Yo, Pray for my people then. Not even that you can say pray for your own people then. Boy, you are coward. Money you put over life, my youth. Fear you put over life. You're not real. None at all. Yeah man, I tell you man. That's a real thing that I tell you. Yeah man. Alright viewers moving on. So now we have Ramesh. I'm Mr. Ramesh followed out and it looked like him a different valiant songs. You understand me? I say because him leave a caption and that one a valiant. Recent single where him drop it ship. And I this away him up to say. One thing, no matter how artists express themselves with positive song or do good for their country and brand, you media will always showcase the worst or flip things to look bad to sell your paper or get views for your media pages. Then you all gonna use our music hashtag dance all, and cause we say how we make people do this and that. Like say some of the biggest music in the world don't praise drugs satan and crime but yet it's always our artists and culture you jamaican media house and politicians and so-called people we uno say full of education who in my view only damage society more than help because you all are hypocrites so people in the area ramisha say and me not nothing positive nor negative they say towards the ramisha say because every man obligated to them own opinion me can't tell nobody with a type nor talk me just can only share my opinion my personal opinion to the world so you the viewers can tell me what to think about ramish opinion and you can share your own opinion towards this topic you see so people tell me what to think moving on all right people moving on so now we have miss kitty one time thing or alleged one time thing in foul though because you don't know miss kitty are uh, married and live her best life happy and ever after you understand me i say miss kitty are the happiest female in the world right now you zoom me i say so i guess this brother followed off it does ruin miss kitty life you understand me as a viewers because the brother say oh miss kitty i one of the worst woman if you married because if you don't have no money you know make no sense you even call to miss kitty i may get to understand why you say because if you, if you get a, a female with money and you don't know life is all about ups and downs suppose you have money today and have it tomorrow miss kitty i go left you that's what the brother i say you understand me as a people and a lot of people say why him choose no come talk about this that just leave a lot of people at one and i say yo it look like this brother fake because the woman get married and a child live her best life. Why you I choose to come bring down the woman from the internet? And you don't know, I'm mostly female, I said that. <laughs> tell her. So, people, check out what I go on. If you are a man and you hear a woman continuously say, you have to have money to get her. If you're broke, 
you can't look in her direction. You cannot get her without you spend how much, how much money upon her. And you are a man looking at this woman, seeing her as wife material. And you dead by her side, lie down in the bed with her, hug her up, go out with her, walk with her. And you know, say if you never have money, she wouldn't dead with you. You are married to her. You are married to a woman who every day publicly in the public domain tell you that she's all about money. And a woman who became an evangelist talking about no broke pocket man right now. Every woman in Jamaica talk about them don't want a broke pocket man. The person who is largely responsible for that is Miss Kitty. Miss Kitty is the one where I tell you, man, them say, when you see broke pocket man, you go over the other side. Remember, you know? These women where I talk about broke pocket man, you know? Them broke, you know? Talk about a pot calling a kettle black. Who don't have money? Who don't have talk about no one a broke pocket man? Who don't have bomb a cloth broke? Who don't have money? Who don't have money? But no one a broke pocket man. How can any man married to a woman who tell you what she's about in the public domain on the internet? It is all over that this woman has repeatedly said that what she's about is money. When you're entering into a relationship, it's about the money. As far as I am concerned. Money and relationship not for going at the same sentence. Because relationships, sexual intimate relationships between a man and a woman can only involve money if it's a transactional relationship. Meaning, if you are a prostitute, if you are a whore. Okay? Now when the thing I go down, this is what I wrote. When the whole thing was going down, when I came out and I said, I went out on a date with Miss Kitty and she two plate of food and the whole place uproar in an uproar. Said me a mama man. Me don't make that clear already. Me's a mama man. Me's a big ma me not only a mama man. Me's a sissy. Me's a mom parlor. In fact, me got changed my name. From now on, me want to be known as mama man. Because anytime you come out and start criticizing one, you're a mama man. You know what you say, you can't say nothing about man. And you're a mama man. Only when you talk about woman, you're a mama man. Because them, they have, the women, women have set us up now in this society. These nowadays women set up the thing now that man not to criticize them. When women are do wrong, you can't come out and criticize them. If you criticize a woman, you are the devil. It means say you hate to man. Remember, you know, woman can't call man junk up. Like how Miss Kitty did up on the, on the internet. Let me not say the radio. Me see her up on the internet. I say, man, I dirty man. Man feet out a paper. You can imagine if me go up on the radio and say, dirty girl. Dirty man. The dirty man there. Man feet out a paper plate. And, and man of you have $80,000 to carry around. That is when I decided that if you are going to openly and publicly bash men, you must be prepared to take some bashing and some embarrassment. And that is why I deliberately came out and spoke about the fact that I didn't spend no $80,000 to carry out. That is how this whole thing started. Me never spent no $80,000 to carry out. And that me come out and say. And I am unapologetic. I told the truth and I would do it again. And anybody when I like it, but suck on mama. Listen. All the little bitches, the little cell pussy bitch them. Where they pan matey and groupie. <laughs> and they pan arm. All over the internet. Pink wall and this and that. I insult and I bash me. <laughs> Lord Jesus Christ. I'm sorry for you. Know. Me know say my mouth big. My mouth big like Alice Bucket. You know only big. It's stinker than Alice Bucket. That one the bad still. Me know I tell a lie. My mouth big like Alice Bucket. But you know only big like Alice Bucket. It's stinker than Alice Bucket too. My belly big like a puzzle. My head big. My nose big. 
Me neck, me not no neck. Me black, me ugly bad. Now that we get all the insults out of the way, why don't we go to what is really important? Why, why uno give so much abortion? Why Jamaican woman? Why uno take 20,000 abortion a year? Why uno give so much jacket? Jamaica has the dubious distinction of being the number one country in the world for paternity fraud. Seven out of every ten people were born in Jamaica, a jacket. Uno dirty, nasty, drunk, bro. I don't know if you talk about I know my belly big, I know my head big, I know my ugly. So what? I know that's important. What is important is why you know I can sell pussy like John Crow. Why as an uno sex, don't sex a man who not stretch out to no hand for money? That is what is important. And that is why I am on this crusade. And that is why I will not stop talking about the bad behavior of women. When you go on like man can't talk about woman. We never talk about woman. If you talk about woman, you're a misogynist. You hate woman. Why when woman a cuss man? Nobody not come out and tell them, say them a misandrist. And them hate man. You ever notice it? Women are above criticism. Women are untouchable. We must talk about woman. And when Miss Kitty, the on the radio, a bash man, I made a conscious decision that I'm going to make her a poster child for all the women who think that men are supposed to now be the weaker sex. Men are not the weaker sex. It is the woman who is supposed to be the weaker sex. But to no cow down man so much. You know how much man want to talk and can't talk. Them afraid to talk. Because they want to lick a pussy from, from you. Know? Or because you don't know, have to insult them. And you don't know, have to cuss them. And you don't know, have to... You don't afraid of that? You don't afraid of that? Stop selling the front. Stop having a man on the yard and a husband and a walk and a fuck like Jankro. Stop giving man so much jacket. Stop take so much abortion. Every man who no sex who no stretch out on a damn hand. Who no low like. Low life junker. Who no. That is what is important. Not how me look. Not how me smell. Not how me tan. And let me ask you this. All I know at all. When I comment section them all over the, the internet at all. What gives you the authority to tell me what I can post, what I can and cannot say when I post. I want to buy my phone. When me I go pay my bill, I'm on time. Me come to no. On a fucking bright, bright no blood clot out of that. One come tell me what I should post, what I can and cannot say. No, I can tell you that you shouldn't be giving so much abash, having so much about that so much picnic. Uno, Jamaica should be the number one country in the world for jacket. Uno should walk and hang on yourself. Uno head in a shame. Uno should have shame on yourself. Uno come and go on like on a smarty. All one, uno, uno in a heels and a go on like, uno walk in a offices and this, that, that. Uno, uno sleep with a man last night and go fuck a next man this morning. That is what is important. Drunk crown. Uh, uh, listen to me, man. Fuck off. Bye-bye. Come back again soon, okay?